Okay guys, so what we're doing today for you is an unbagging of a Forge World set of armour. So obligatory bag of bases, you kind of need those if you're going to be making anything. And let's just put my bits out across the top there, just so I can pull them all back in a moment. So what we're unbagging today for you is the Mark V Armour Space Marine Assault Squad. So the Mark V Armour is um, in the full blown stages of the Horus Heresy when there's a bit of a supply issue getting decent armour marks out. So the, the Mark V is an amalgamation of, of older armour marks that are held together and it has those signature, come on focus in, has these signature rivets through the legs, through the arms, chest plates, um, holding sort of several layers of not quite up to grade um, armour plates together just so they could get them out quickly. So we'll start off as I've got them in my hand with the leg sprues. So you get these two standing poses, which are absolutely gorgeous. You've got the power cabling running up the top there, um, the rivets going through like I said, and the classic ball joint on the top. And in this set we have the running poses. So a little bit of uh, hot water and I can move these around set them how I want them, clean the flash off them obviously and again the rivets all the way around there nice set of armour coming up from there uh, I should say five marines in a bag obviously five legs uh, so the actual torso for the Mark V you've got the cabling going across it for the jump packs and there's no real variation in the torsos they are what they are um, so we'll put those down there. Now the exciting part, the actual Forge World jump packs. Not a million miles away from things like the um, Chapter House Studios or the Max Mini ones, but they are quite nice to see the open workings into them there. The standard sort of marine backpack that they're based around. I quite like this glowing orb bit in the back here. Um, uh, it looks to me, with that catch across it there, like it's a fuel canister. So um, I'm gonna have some fun getting these all painted up. It's a shot down into the vents there, and the fans at the top. So they're, they're pretty nice, they're really awesome. And again, you get five in the kit, sprue two, should be a sprue of three, but obviously one's fallen off. So, what else do you get in? Oh, lean over everything. Shoulder pads. Five standard shoulder pads. Nothing to them, and I won't be using these. These will be replaced with my Night Lord specific Legion pads. But you get a row of five, and again, one's come off of these distinctive studded heresy mark shoulder pads. Which should be very, very nice. Uh, they are the ones that I'm going to be using, so they're going to have one shoulder pad heresy, one shoulder pad with the, the Metal Games Workshop Night Lord ones. Now here's where it gets fun for these guys. The actual arms... They got no hands, man! They got no hands! A uh, variety of different poses on the arms. So you could... Is my iPad going off? Uh, yep. It's a uh, number of ways that you could put them on. You could bend them around, but then you have sprues with the hands separately, pistols, chain swords. So that's one weapon sprue, another weapon sprue, another weapon sprue, uh, another weapon sprue, and you guessed it, another weapon sprue. One for each marine, so you can have different combinations of hands and which hand you want holding the gun, which hand you want holding the chain sword. Another offset of arms. The last little bit that you get in here ooh, are the heresy heads. Again, with those lovely distinctive rivets through them. It's a nice kit, it really is, but it ain't cheap. It really isn't cheap. I think it was about 32 quid for these, something like that. Um, so I bought 10, 10 models, so two packs. Um, 
I am really looking forward to getting them painted and into a squad. They are going to be brilliant in my Night Lords. Uh, so Brian and Chuffy, yes, there's a Night Lord video gone up. Leave me alone! <laughs> I'm just not feeling much on them at the moment, but I'm looking forward to getting these guys together. Uh, get a nice squad of 10 heresy marks out there. And I might use them as um, the start of Lacorpheus' Raptors. Or I might actually get a squad of Raptors. We'll see. I like having a lot of assaulty troops. They're very Night Lordy, so we'll see where we go from there. But that is the set of Mark V Heresy Armour assault squads that you get from Forge World, guys. Nice kit. All commands, bolt pistols, and chain swords. So you will have to raid your bits box if you want to upgrade one to carry um, a plasma pistol as your sergeant or anything at all like that. So um, I'll have a look and see what I've got. See if I can find off uh, some corn berserkers because that's quite a nice, quite a nice looking plasma pistol that one. We'll see what we come up with. But until then, thanks for watching. Stay tuned guys and we'll see what I can do about getting these guys built.